Hey guys, Cal Torak here. A lot of people have been asking for updates on our dungeon and gold farms. Unfortunately, Blizzard added a mechanic this phase that makes AoE dungeon farms very, very difficult. After 60 seconds in combat, elites become immune to slow, snares, and stuns. Basically all crowd control effects. After 2 minutes in combat, they move at an increased speed. I believe it's between 200 and 300 percent, but I'm not quite sure. This mechanic has been added to Zulfarak, Marudon, and BRD. We can assume it's going to be added to all level 60 dungeons. I believe they added this mechanic in Season of Mastery to prevent dungeon boosting. This change essentially made all our old gold farms impossible. You basically only have a few minutes to do the pull, or mobs are moving so fast they catch you and you die. The slow immunity makes it very, very difficult for us to stack the mobs. So even if you do get to your kite spot, the mobs are often super split. There are some techniques the Mage Discord has been cooking up to try and stack the mobs of Lips and Ice Block, but they can be a real struggle to learn and master. We do have a pull that I'm currently trying to get down. I'm calling it the Shatter Pull, because it's the name of the mage that made this pull. While it has been influenced by myself, viewers in my chat, Taiwan, and other mages in the Discord, I would say this pull is at least 80% of his work, so mega shout out to Shatter. If we can get this clean and mastered, it's quite possible this is where I'll be leveling at the start of phase 4, from 50 to 57 probably. It'll be a few days or even a week before I'm confident enough in the pull to make a guide. But a guide is indeed coming. Hopefully, we can get Blizzard to remove this anti-boosting mechanic. While it's here though, we are absurdly limited in the farms we can do. Anyways, here's the current version of the pull. Biggest I've done personally is 125, but we can get up to 150 for sure. A guide will be out in the coming days once it's mastered. Enjoy the video, like, subscribe, watch my streams, and see you in the next one. We're gonna do it right this time. This is a tough pull. All right, let's get it. <clears throat> this is the one, boys. No boss. No boss, no death, kill mobs. Look at this pull I had yesterday. Where is it? 125 mobs, where is it? I don't remember where it is. There it is. One of those 125 mob pulls. We're doing one of those right now. Let's find a song I want to listen to. change of music, sorry. Well, 
When you turn around, blink through that first pack of horrors. Too late. Oh, gotcha. Almost just fell in the water. I'm gonna stop reading you right now, Shadow. I almost just fell in the water. Blink through this one. Gotcha. And this will make blink up for the boss, I'm assuming. Sweet. Yeah, that was where I was wondering the other day was, um, where is the optimal blink location there to where you'll have it back up for the boss, so... Perfect. The wizard is ahead of it again. Please don't... Yes! Yes! Oh my god. We're gonna go ahead and swiftness pot, even though we don't... This actually felt like a really clean route overall, so I don't think I needed the swiftness pot there. Might have even better to save for a mana pot sometimes on that pool, but... I'm trying to get that guy with the living flame, and hopefully it ticks one of those worms. Nope. It, no, it just barely missed those worms. Rip. Should have put it on one of his ads. Got greedy trying to save mana. Here we go. Alright, I hate when that fucker's far. But if we don't aggro this guy early, we can wait until he's closer to get him aggroed by each other, so. I'll just jump up and do an evocate real quick. Get one more tick? No, okay. The mage armor on. Where's that idiot? There he is. I did get the dagger. I'm not killing Princess anymore, man. Where's this idiot? Get aggro. Y'all quit being done with your pathing. Don't crit me, please. I hate these fucking giants. Would you cast Boulder, close guy? Okay, I'm just gonna do one reset real quick. I feel like I can just do it now, but maybe do one more. Is some kind of new boosting strat? Hopefully. I'm going to do one more. I don't think I need to do one more. Those look pretty good, but...
All right, we're gonna go for it. I'm probably gonna die, but I'm feeling the death, but I'm going for it. Place, 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 place. Place, 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 place. No, 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 no. That felt good. That felt good. Be careful. I'm fucking up my pathing a little bit, but this feels good. I've done a lot of damage to the giants, and I think I've pumped a little baby, maybe too many pyroblasts into the giants because it did make me lose a lot of mana. Um, and I gotta make sure I jump my move when I'm up there. But I lost a lot of mana to pyros, I feel. I need to send out way more living bombs, I feel. I need this guy to cast a boulder at me so I can get the other guys closer. This is obviously with no consume, so if I were to use like full consumes and world buffs and this was clean, like you could obviously do this way faster. And if you stop refreshing living bombs on targets that already have it, you save a lot of mana too. A living bomb check macro? Is that a, oh. Huh. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. That makes a lot of sense to be honest, yeah. You can't cast living bomb if living bomb's on the target. That definitely seems like something I should invest my time into. Absolutely. That is a good idea, my friend. One thousand percent. One thousand percent a good idea. Um, so we can stack a lot of these because they're non-elites. So we can get them a little bit closer to the stack. This can get a lot faster, though. This kill time is really slow, in my opinion. This can get a lot faster, though. Only 9,000 mana back. I, I, I lost a lot of mana early on spamming Pyroblasts, which you should spam Pyroblasts into the big guys, but I should have invested, like, way more into... Um, I was getting a lot of Pyroprox, and I was, like, I just got happy-go-lucky with them, so... Um, I think that's the last Elite, and then it's non-Elite, so it should be free from there. 
Obviously, it was really slow if we had to use two Evo Cakes, but... I don't think so, but maybe. I have a macro that doesn't let me cast Arcane Blast in the middle of a um, Arcane Missiles channel. That macro works, so I don't see why... Uh I mean, the other spots don't work, Azuz. This is the spot we have to use. The other spots don't work anymore. I would love to use the old spots. Nope. They add a mechanic that made... You can't do the old pulls anymore. They, they've added a mechanic that's made those pulls, like, impossible. Unfortunately. This is, like, the best we've got right now. It's possible someone finds something new, but of the old stuff, it's all dead. 14 minutes inside. Combat time. Where's my combat time? Which one is it? Is that one it? 1109 plus 24 because that's the monoliths at the end that spawn or what? Is it 1109 plus 24 or just 1109 combat time? I think it's just 1109. So, as is, they added a mechanic to elites that after three minutes in combat, they move 300% faster and they're immune to slow. So, any pool that takes more than three minutes is impossible. Because the mobs are going to go so fast, they'll catch you and they'll kill you. Because they become immune to slow after one minute. So, you're limited to a three minute pool. If you cannot get to the safe spot in three minutes, you die. But also because you can't slow them, you can't stack them easily. That's why I was doing the bullshit with the double ice block lip. Is because we're like... We have to do really ghetto shit right now. Um, I'm not saying those pulls become possible eventually, but... because you're, You can't be running for more than like three and a half minutes or mobs are going to catch you. You're really limited to a short pull. Like maybe a 140 mob pull gets popped out of nowhere, but... Um, the, all the gods in the mage discord, like Taiwan and shit, they quit this phase. All the people that main mage have re-rolled hunters or quit. Because it's like just so impossible to farm right now. <laughs> 